published 2006 est, the 10th of December 2017 updated 2021 est, the 10th of December 2017 more than four out of five men convicted of grooming girls for sex are Asian, according to a report. Seven in ten of the Asian men responsible are of Pakistani Muslim background, it found. The study by the Quilliam Think Tank, which focuses on countering Islamic extremism, was based on court evidence given by Asian men during trials of abuser gangs. The report, which will be made public this week, said that girls from the Asian community are seen as commodities to be protected, whereas girls from outside of the community are seen as fair game. Nine men were sentenced in 2012 for abusing young girls in Rochdale. Top row. Left to right Abdul Rauf, Hamid Safi, Muhammad Sajid and Abdul Aziz Bottom row left to right Abdul Qayyum, Adil Khan, Muhammad Amin and Kabir Hassan findings were gathered by British Pakistani authors, who say they hope it will encourage Asian communities to take responsibility, the authors said, in attempts to protect the sentiments of the British Pakistani community, we have failed vulnerable. Young girls who have suffered years of irreversible damage, Shabir Ahmed, the ringleader of the Rochdale child sex grooming gang they added that there was a disproportionate representation of males with Asian heritage convicted in such cases, with the Asian male perpetrator white female victim dynamic serving as the prominent feature of these grooming gangs, most of these men are of Pakistani Muslim origin, and the victims that have come forward so far are almost exclusively young white girls. A series of high-profile cases have resulted in the conviction of abuse gangs in cities, including Rochdale and Oxford. The Rochdale case led to widespread allegations that police and local authorities were ignoring sex offences by gangs because of a fear of being labelled racist. Researchers examined 58 sex gang cases from 2005 to 2017. Of the 264 offenders, 84% were Asian, mostly Pakistani, 8% were black and 7% were white. Pictured as Molly Windsor depicting one of the abuse victims in the BBC drama Three Girls Gilliam's Hurrah Rafiq told the Sunday Times, there has been a lot of coverage of grooming gangs, from the politically correct, who don't want to talk about it, and the bigots who want to use it for hate, not talking about it doesn't make the problem go away, and letting bigots hijack the debate creates further division in society. We as a society need to tackle this head-on. Sorry we are not currently accepting comments on this article.